Hey, what's going on guys? Well, I was reading the comments on the video I did on the plasmatic lighter and a lot of people want to see it working. You know what I mean? They're a little skeptical about it. Uh, first of all, let me just say that this doesn't replace uh, a regular lighter. A regular lighter with an actual flame is going to be more of an effective lighter. And of course, it wouldn't be <laughs> a good video in the summertime if someone wasn't blowing the lawn. So, sorry about the background noise. But anyway, uh, people are asking about lighting candles and cigars and pipes and all that kind of stuff. Uh, right off the bat, you have to see that how this works is you're having basically an arc, okay? And in order to light something, that arc has to touch what you're trying to light. So as far as a pipe lighter, um, I wouldn't recommend this. The gun one would work a heck of a lot better because it's exposed in the Zippo format. It's not going to work very good for a pipe, okay? Can you do it? Probably. Is it going to be easy? Probably not. Uh, the same as a large cigar would be difficult to do with the, the Zippo style one. You'd, much, you'd have better luck with the, uh, the gun style lighter because the tip is exposed. You can basically put it down in a pipe or reach more surface area on a cigar. All right, a smaller cigar like this, like Cigarellos, I have used this, I know it works, okay? This is a bigger one, a bigger diameter Cigarello than uh, the other ones, like the Al Capones or something similar. Uh, so I haven't tried something of this size yet, but I'm gonna do it in this video. Uh, as far as like a candle, okay? This being a votive, you'll see here, okay? And by the way, this is not pre-lit, so there's wax covering here. It's gonna be easier if it's ready burnt. But let me try to give you an angle here so you guys can see this working. You get nice and close. See that it lights it just fine, and relighting is even easier. There you go. But in order to relight this, you need to get in there, you need that arc to be able to touch whatever you're trying to light. So, although this worked great, if you have like a Yankee candle jar candle and the wax is down towards the bottom, you're not going to literally be able to fit this down there so that arc can touch the wick of the candle okay so you know you have to kind of imagine anything you're trying to use this uh to light whether it's like a fuse for fireworks you know or a uh, cigarette whatever it is that arc has to touch it but it is generating a lot of heat okay so it will light whatever you know you're trying to light on fire as long as you can touch it but as far as lighting a cigar as long as that arc is touching it will light okay i don't know if you guys can see that just the corner here Is this more effective than a standard light or no? Of course it isn't. The reason why, why you might want to buy something like this is because it's pretty damn cool. All right? A piece of wrapper come off in my mouth. So, yeah, I mean, it's smoking. Did it light the entire foot of the cigar? No, it didn't. So again, I wouldn't say this is effective as a regular lighter, but it does work. So you can see, we get actual flame. It doesn't take all that much time to do that but it has to actually touch the cigar. So this diameter cigar was lit in a matter of seconds. I would imagine if you use a, uh, a larger uh, diameter cigar, you can also light it. It's just, you have to be, like for me, I like toasting a foot first before I actually light it. But if you're one of the guys that just brings your flame right to a cigar, cigar and starts puffing on it, it's gonna work just fine. All right, so there's something to keep in mind there. That's pretty much it. The other thing that I wanted to mention too, I didn't mention in the first video is that you know, with a standard lighter, the drawback is that you can run out of fuel, right? Well, you can still run out of a charge. So it doesn't have anything over a standard lighter in that sense. The only difference is that it's practically free to recharge something like this, you know, through your computer or something, as opposed to buying fuel from a store for a standard lighter. Even like a Bic, you're not refilling them and they're cheap to replace, but you're constantly replacing them and run out of fuel. Whereas this is reusable and you don't have to buy fuel for it. Um, but you know, everything's gonna have its ups and downs. The main reason why you'd get this is just because it's pretty damn cool. That's pretty much it. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you soon. Take care.